Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new reading. Uh, due to some technical problems, this video is being uploaded two days late. As you can hear, my nose is all blocked. I'm not keeping well. But energy check-in is important because I know many of you rely on this for your weeks. Uh, so here I am. So without a further ado, let's get started. Okay, so this week, let's see what your overall energy is going to be like. I'm using a new deck today. The deck is Everyday Tarot. Yes, Everyday Tarot. And your card for this week's energy is Knight of Pentacles. Okay, I'll pick out one more card. Okay, let's get some guidance about your career or anything that's going on in your career. Queen of Pentacles. Wow, all earthly energies this time. And one for your relationships, the moon. Okay, all right. So, overall theme of your reading is Knight of Pentacles. Uh, so, the Knight of Pentacles talks about over contemplation. You have planned everything properly. So now it is time for you to take action with this Knight of Pentacles card. Uh, Knight of Pentacles can also talk about some opportunity being offered to you this week. Um, it can be a career related thing. It can be a relationship. Maybe um, you and your partner move into a proper conversation or if you have been having fights you guys come into reconciliation and you guys talk everything out all the negative energy gets cleared um, because the knight of pentacles is a card of also grounding yourself and being prepared for what is coming so maybe if you have an energy of being over anxious or over uh, doing things overthinking things then this week it is your time to just let all of that go and try to just recognize little little things that are happening around you and finally taking actions for things you've been planning for a long time now or maybe if you're planning to talk to somebody about something and you, you're you just thinking what will they think then this is your time to just let all those extra thoughts go away and go ahead and talk to the person or go ahead and talk to your colleagues if that applies to your career as well the next card here for your career life is queen of pentacles so the queen of pentacles talks about um having that understanding that okay you are in a safe space you are growing and everything that is happening in your work life is going to lead you somewhere so nothing this week uh is going to give you that sort of a self-doubt or that sort of a problem thought that okay something is wrong no nothing is wrong you are on the right track queen of pentacles can also talk about nurturing yourself so if you have been at it at your career and if you're looking to just uh know that okay this is not what your life's gonna be like you're going to give yourself that much happiness or you're going to give yourself that much joy peace if not all these emotions just time to make yourself comfortable in where you are in your life right now so i think that should help you and the last card i have is for your relationships it is a major card the moon card so the moon card as you can see it talks about the shadow aspect of your relationships right now maybe uh, there are some issues which are underlying and you need to sort those out with your partner uh, this relationship card doesn't only mean romantic relationship it can be with a friend it can be um, 
with family it can be with your siblings it can be with your brother sister best friends parents uh, grandparents anything anything will apply to this relationship card so whatever is the situation please make sure to note that this is something which will bring out the problems in your relationships and help you clear those out permanently so that the same problems don't arise again and you can move forward into this relationship in a much stronger way uh, this card can also show up when there are some sort of misunderstandings happening or when you are into way too much um, overthinking and have so much self-doubt have so much of toxic thoughts that you need to let all those go because as you can see in the picture also there is a moon but the moon is in the shadow of the sun so you need to understand that you have to recognize your light you have to recognize the good parts of you and you have to also accept the bad part of you it can be any of your habits everybody has some good and the bad parts as we all know now it is time for you to accept those parts and love them as much as you love the good parts of you that will make you heal that will bring out the comfort in yourself which will eventually heal your relationships outside this can also talk about self-love maybe you have been too strict on yourself and now it is the time to you know improve your relationship with yourself and heal yourself and give yourself that easiness so that you can move towards life in a much more comfortable way so i hope these messages resonate with you uh let's see an oracle card again from my own way deck the turn of time deck if you would like to order this deck it is for readers as well as non-readers it is a universal message deck which comes with a guidebook and a cute little box so make sure to check out the description to order this deck or even make an inquiry all right so the message for you from the universe is sorry okay so i feel that this card has come up in accordance to your relationship uh, message this week maybe there are some misunderstandings going on which needs to be uh, sorted <coughs> I'm sorry I have a bad throat so these cards imply that either you or your partner should reconcile should talk to each other should make that easy transition and let all the misunderstandings go away i told you this can be a kind of misunderstanding also it's time to you know just if you have been rude to your partner if this applies to you make sure you apologize to your partner or the person involved in this situation and so that you can talk to them in a much free manner and sort everything out all the misunderstandings out if that, that does not apply to you maybe your partner will come up and apologize to you and just tell you how much you mean to them so i feel that this week apology should be one of the key themes which will make things much 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 better yes it can be a difficult time to pass yes it can be a little bit um uneasy but all of these things will direct you towards a stronger relationship a stronger understanding of yourself or the other person and that should make you guys much 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 more uh, deeper in connection to each other so i feel that that is the main takeaway from this reading so yes that's all what i have for you today please make sure to follow me on instagram and subscribe to this channel for weekly energy check-ins and more readings i do the detailed readings obviously uh, which comes out every week it's either wednesday or sunday so you have to keep a tab because right now my schedule is being a little bit up and down but definitely coming in place within the coming couple of weeks um if you're being called to and if you like weekly horoscopes please make sure to join my new Philia core community it is a lifetime membership program free for my viewers right now but definitely being uh, 
a paid thing very soon so please make sure to check it out from the detail in the description box below it is a lifetime membership uh where we do too many things at once all the membership works are described in the description below please subscribe and join the core community for your personalized weekly zodiac horoscopes apart from that please make sure to subscribe to this channel as well don't forget to do it i i know i mentioned it earlier but that would be a great help for me on my journey to youtube so i'll see you next time bye